Well, howdy there, superstars! How are you all doing on this... What is tonight? Wednesday night? Something like that? I don't even know anymore. <laughs> My brain is fried. How are you all tonight? I hope you're having an awesome time. It is me, hi, coming at you live, alive, and fully digitized from across the internet. And we're gonna have some fun, because we're gonna be hopping back into Super Mario RPG. Man, I love this game. This was my favorite game growing up. This remake is so delicious. It is so wonderful. And oh, just the colors, the music, everything. Mwah. Chef's kiss. <laughs> oh, yes. I hope y'all are having as much fun as I am with this one. It is, it's just something when you go back and play something from your childhood and go, Oh, it's even better. It's perfect. <laughs> But, hello to all y'all in Chatland tonight. Special thanks, as always, to the Diamond Planet and KK Bug, helping to keep everything running nice and smoothly. About as smoothly as we can get before, you know, everything starts going crazy with the bots and frame rate drops and, you know, just everything that can go wrong when, you know, you've got a few glitches in the system. <laughs> you know, some of the fun I cause. Some of the fun... ...is caused for me. <laughs> But hello to everyone else popping in early. How are y'all doing? We got the dynamic duo. Hello there. Hello, Dolly Chen. Childish Onigiri. Hello, Mika. Angel Edits. Good evening tonight. How are you doing, Starlight Nightingale? And who else we got popping in right now for early on? Where are you in chat? Where are y'all? Where are y'all? Hello there, Lily. Hello, Jillian. And hello, Sierra. Hello again, or correct me if it's Sierra or Kira. I think I asked that before, but I do want to make sure I got that right. So K sound or C sound. Don't let me get that wrong. <laughs> any y'all got any fun plans going on this week? Anything y'all been doing? Oh, hello, Blue Dolphin. I apologize. I did not see you beforehand. Hello. Anything y'all have been doing? Any fun new video games by chance? Maybe? <laughs> I know, it's like there's 9 million good video games coming out right now and just, you know, picking up one, picking up two, you know, playing them all till dawn, and then just spending, you know, the entire week playing Minecraft. Because, why not? <laughs> but, I'll tell you what. How about we just jump straight on into things? I know, getting a little bit of a late start tonight as, you know, just had a little bit of stuff at the process earlier. A little bit of business. But we're gonna enjoy this adventure. <laughs> I'm already in my sprite form, so, you know, starting to finally learn how to control my forms a bit. Well, at least for what you guys can see. So, you know, just kind of jumping in and out of things, you know, try not to cross the streams too much and all of a sudden end up as a Goomba again. So. How about we jump on into our Switch? Get ready to hear that click. Yes. That wonderful bit of UI that is the Switch menu. Nice. It's parody. I kind of wish they were going to add another theme at some part. Some point. Blech. Words. I is can word good. Not aphasia in the slightest. I was kind of hoping they were going to add another theme at some point. But you know. At this point, at the classic theme, it just, it works. It looks good. We dig it. <laughs> <laughs> Jumping through, making sure everything's good. You guys got game audio? You hearing those nice little switch clicks? Huh? Huh? Nice clicks? Clicks? We're going to have an ASMR stream, and suddenly it'll just be nice and quiet, and we're just going to focus on... The subtle sounds and amplify them as you hear every smacking mouth noise. Anyway, enough of that. That's on my OnlyFans. Wink. <laughs> what's up, Diamond? Before we get started, what's going on? It is 69 degrees right now. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> so nice, in fact. Let's jump on in. A real tiger. 
Oh, that's fun. <laughs> I know. I like to wording my words so that I can word while I word and hopefully the word will, you know, try to word and make the word like word the word. Word is the word. Word is the bird. <laughs> we'll find out if anyone else. I keep forgetting to turn off that overlay, but now. Ah, well. Ba 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 been getting the funniest moments of this channel for over three years. If she's not clipped it, well, you know, it's probably in the VODs, but... <laughs> anyway, shall we play a game? Who else is in the Chaos Quartet? Who indeed? <gasps> you. It's you. As a wise sage once said, despite everything, it's still you. <laughs> the yellow tiles. Yes, our little tutorial for how these guys work. Oh, Roseway. Choo choo. There we are. We'll come back to that mushroom later. Right now, we're gonna fight these starfish. Ooh, we do want the flower point, though. What's going on? Ah, uh, yes, child Onigiri, what's up? Come on, come on! Starfish! Starfish! Starfishes love you! Come on. I want to battle. Make it like a Pokémon battle. Make it like a cheeky Pokémon battle. Come on, wake up. Come on, come on. You can do it. Your animation is nice and smooth. Let us enter this battle. Let us enter into a battle. No, don't don't go away. Oh, heck. Dreamland. Yeah, I know it's a little bit later for you. <laughs> Got a bit of a later start tonight. Just regrettably, bit of a long day. Starfishes love you. No, don't wake up as... There we go. There we go. Ooh, Snapdragons. They got lips. Ah, yes. So my outro song is connected. Yours forever from the Tetris effect. Absolute beautiful piece. And, um... Ah, oh, look at Malo. He's so happy. Oh, did we actually equip the cane? Yep, we got the cane. But, uh... It is... Absolute beautiful piece. One of the, one of the signature songs of the Tetris effect. And, um... Just one of my favorite pieces. Sivinger! <gasps> Mr. Justin Green. Justin Green has joined the party, everyone! Yeah, forget Gino. We're not seeing Gino today. We're seeing Justin. How you be, my dude? <laughs> but yeah, so that is one of the two songs I usually use my outro. The other one... Actually, you know what? Let's pause for a second. I want to see... All right, Malo. What you got? What are these guys saying? What do they say? What does the shy guy say? He's weak to fear. Yeah, aren't we all? <laughs> there we go. Hold tight, Mario. You know, just be a meat shield for a moment. What's the star slap say? Your cousin. 
Good night, Malo. Well, at least we can still block in our sleep. I'll say one thing that's nice is I also managed to figure out a way that I can get the audio timed correctly. <gasps> Did you just wiggle your hips at me? Rude. Rude. You wiggle your hips. The star slap wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. <laughs> Selena Quintanilla's life. I need to check that out one of these days. I know uh, talking about studio stuff, I recently had put in a new compressor in my uh, studio and took the chance to do some cleaning because it's... Uh, I needed to do some cleaning. <laughs> Boom! Bop, bada beep, bow. They call me Arachne because I lack knees. <laughs> uh, no, I have not decorated for Christmas yet. In fact, I need to get I need to get myself a little tree one of these days because. I, uh, yeah, I keep missing with Mario. I'm not focused right. But, um, yeah, I've been meaning to get myself a little tree just so I can put up some ornaments that I've accumulated over the years. Christmas always sneaks up on me. It used to be a tradition that I would do it with my family, but I kind of forget about it when it's myself because I go, hey, you know, go out and enjoy just Christmas out. Ooh, now I don't remember which way is the correct way. Do you know the way? Holidays are coming, the holidays are coming. Hello, shy guy. There we go. Slap that guy. Wow. Ow. Timing is a little weird with a star slap. For some reason, I always thought... Hmm. There we go. I know I will have a little bit of Christmas stuff going on as I'm uh, actually going to be out of town for a few days. So, heading to a new IP address. Bam. Bow. <laughs> Indeed, I do have a Christmas wish, but I'm afraid I'm going to have to keep that private for right now. You know, can't go spoiling your wish. Nice to share it after it comes true. So, let's see. I feel like I remember there being... I always keep hitting... I always keep hitting Y. Just because I keep thinking that's the run button from the old game. Choo -choo. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I know. So, tradition with my family, my father would usually go to get the tree at the, um, usually like the first weekend of December. And so we'd go out, go get the tree, usually get it with my aunt, and then get it decorated. Mom pulls out everything from the basement, would have, you know, 40 years worth of just Christmas memories. How do I get over there again? Maybe I gotta go, that's right, I gotta go over this side. Uh, so Justin and I, by blood, we're not related. Hello there, weird thief. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Fight the shy guy dangling. Boom.
Bam. <laughs> Man. Were we blood twins in this life, that would be thoroughly chaotic. So, it's a hard thing, Christmas versus Halloween, that both have, both have different significances for me. That I do, I enjoy, I like the fun of Halloween, but I will admit that Christmas often has a lot of sentimental memories. Oh, <laughs> Mario actually practices in between attacks. Nice. Nice. Uh oh. Well, nap time. Or mute time, that's right. Man, Malo can't say anything. Yeah, so Christmas usually has a lot of sentimental memories with family. Uh, I, it really is hard to tell, because... Thanksgiving also kind of falls in the same vibe as Christmas, but oftentimes a little bit less chaotic. That with Christmas, there's a lot of planning. Thanksgiving... Given my family rare... They didn't host Thanksgiving much. So, not as much chaos as Christmas. So, could usually enjoy more the holiday. Let's see what we got here. Well, magics. Many ladies have tried to tell us apart, but so far none have succeeded. I'm Justin, and I'm Mihai. Usually the way you can tell us apart is by our aesthetics when it comes to streaming online. Although now that Justin has a pirate Sona, um... We'll see if the lines start getting blurred even further. <laughs> a reference? What? Hey, come on. Don't you run away. But still, Mario resisted. <laughs> Thank you, Lakitu! Alright then, so now getting back to this part. Moving on down. Yay. Okay, that's the pattern of that one. Yeah, that's probably the easiest thing, is that Justin does tend to be a bit lower in general than me. There we go. Nailed it. All right, little star. Boom! Woohoo! So, actually, that's a good question. I think... Justin and I are... Yeah, I think we are pretty much equal height. I think if there's anything, it might be an inch difference between the two of us. So, singing-wise, yeah, Justin, more baritone bass. And I'd say me, baritone Barry Tenor. Once upon a lifetime ago... I was actually bass two in choir, in part because I didn't have any other one else who was willing to try going that low. I know. We like to vary things up, change our height from day to day, reformat a little bit. There we go. Boom boom. Ow. <laughs> now 
There we go. Hello, little crook. D dude! Stop running away! Bruh. Bruh. Come on, I want your loot. Share your loot with me. You stole it, and I want to steal it from you. Anyway, let's take a look and see what the Snapdragon's got to say. With those bodacious lips. Hmm, you too, huh? <laughs> I was gonna say, I feel like... So... Justin might have to be the other queen of Christmas, uh... Not gonna say anything, but you know what to redeem next time he streams. Wink. There's an old AMV and just seeing the Snapdragon with the lips, all I can hear in my head is, I love my lips! Teehee. <laughs> all right, Shy Guy. Boom. Bop, bada bow, bow. But I'm not a rapper. So I tend to be more one to dress up for Halloween. Um, kids would come to where I grew up. Not so much where I live nowadays. Plus, you know, I'm still... I'm... I will always be a kid with my spirit in the internet. So, you mentioned dressing up? Yes, please. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. In fact, it was fun. I had a Halloween wedding I had gone to just a few days for actual Halloween. And, um, yeah, so dressed to the nines for that. <laughs> Let's see what we've got going on here. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> ah, there we go. Time to finally attack that crook. Or at least find out what he's got to say. What you got to say? What's in your head? Let's invade your thoughts. All right. Well, at least I got what I cared about. You fire your pea shooter at me. I'll say what's funny is that the way that the lullaby is, if any of y'all have played the absolute masterpiece classic, Mario is Missing, it sounds like the very down-tempo groove version of that. Absolute peak game. Best Mario game ever. Or best Luigi game, I should say. <laughs> Ooh, Dahlia Hawthorne. That is a fun choice. What an... <laughs> yeah, now there, there's some fun... There's some fun character development right there. Ooh, Dahlia Hawthorne. Oh, Todd! Now kick their butts! There we go. All right. Down you go, Arachne. I know I, um... Yeah, I've got multiple favorites from the Ace Attorney series. Dahlia Hawthorne... Very well written character. I. Oh, oh god. I, I know it's way beyond any point of spoilers. If anyone does not want to hear about Dahlia Hawthorne, now is your few second warning to mute your stream. She is an absolute. just. pure evil. 
and the way that, you know, you just have this gentle essence that she goes about and, you know, is so innocent. Yeah, she's a good character. Anyway, feel free to unmute now. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I know I've got a lot of favorites myself. Particularly with the prosecutors. Uh, there's, there's something about the prosecutors. They're just... Mm, they're all such assholes, and I love them. Also, what's this? We got an army up here? Oh! <gasps> it's your boy! <laughs> All right, people, farm ranks. Jagger, head of the shell warriors. <laughs> Wizard Koopa, master of the hooded sorcerers. Yes, Mister. And last but not least. Goomhilda, Grand Dame of the Growling Goombas. Oh, how progressive. It's a lady in charge of the Goombas. This is our finest moment. Bowser's minions are invincible. We shall be victorious. The bridge is down, but we'll find a way to get back in. Move out on the devil. I know, with Diamond's visor, definitely definitely, I can see the gold oak comparisons. Of all the prosecutors, there is... Yeah. I love Godo, Edgeworth. I, I, it's so hard to pick. I think Godo for his calmness. And... Edgeworth just so endearing how... You have such a posh and smarmy prosecutor who, of course, strives for perfection. And, you know, it turns out to be a total weeb on the side as he's reading Steel Samurai comics all day long. And Franziska. Foolishly foolhardy fool in your foolish ways. I'm going to lower your foolish salary, you fool! And poor Gumshoe just taking the brunt of everything. Even... Why am I trying to remember his name for a second? I was thinking of his Japanese name, Garyu. Ah, uh, bu 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 Clavier Gavin. That's right. Just, mm. Rock and roll prosecutor. Love it. E even Simon Blackwell. Just, once you move Phoenix Wright to a Western setting, you know, you set it in Los Angeles, so suddenly you have this comic weeb vibe to everyone that, oh, it makes perfect sense. You have this samurai aesthetic prosecutor, and just all of a sudden, no, he's just a weeb now. Well, anyway, shall we head on over to Rosetown? As I go to also for coffee as I sit here enjoying a cup myself. I drink 17 cups a day, not one fewer, not one more. The trial ends once I've had my 17th cup. <laughs> yeah, I actually gave myself a scar from trying to make a Godot mask years ago. So right now, I've got a Sumatra. I've got a Sumatra bean that um, is from R's Coffee Roastery out of... I'm trying to think exactly where he's based out of. He's out of North Jersey. And, um, wonderful roasts. He just curates, he curates all of his stuff, and, um, I order it on over my way. Made this one to an Americano. So, let's go see Rose Town. Uh... Something's not right. Hello! Hey, you good? Uh-oh. Hmm. Something's wrong. Oh! <gasps> Uh-oh. She's stuck, too. 
Hello, sir. <laughs> I'll say, remembering back to the game, the old man going out to pump water. It really hits harder after a few years ago where all of a sudden it's just, you know what? Whatever happens is going to happen. Just, I have to keep living my life. Yeah, it is kind of dangerous outside. Your grandson, you say? Yep, he's kind of stuck. Uh oh. Yep, that's a problem. Yeah. Help this dude get back up. Let me help you out, bud. That once I can jump on your head. Come on, dude. That, that, there. Okay. Should not be that hard to do. Also. <laughs> pretty bored, huh? Don't judge me. I like to explore. I need to get some more milk so I can make some cappuccinos. I tend to make Americanos because they are easier and I've gotten into pour overs recently. Favorite. I love a good latte or a mocha, though. Nah. He's got treasures. We don't want to take his treasure. Well, except for the hidden one. Teehee. Where is the hidden one, though? Hey, kid! There it is. Let's help our dude get back up to his house. So, yeah, for most things I love... I'll use I'll use regular milk for it. I've never actually tried to make like a latte with chocolate milk just cuz I'll make it with the different parts. Yep, your treasures are good, sir. A secret? What? Ooh. Left, left, straight, right. Interesting. What will we find? Aha. Yeah, kid, you're probably gonna get a bit of a spanking. Just gonna say right now. Just, you know, just a hunch. Left, left, straight, right. Sing requ- Okay, so I apologize. I did miss that. What? Did you have a preference, JD? Are we doing more Christmas? Doing more Christmas? <laughs> I have not seen the mushrooms yet. I have another life, but you know. One terrorizes people. The other is nice. Mmm, your husband has not come back. Yeah, probably paralyzed by the arrows. Yeah, kind of inconvenient. We enter through the back door. Bop, 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 bop. Yay. Oh, whoops. Let's buy ourselves some swag. Uh, let's see. So since it is Christmas season, get a little George Michael in there. Rest in power, King. Can I reach George Michael's range? He is a little bit up there. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see, let's see. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart, but the very next day, you gave it away. 
this year to save me from tears i'll give it to someone special last christmas i gave you my heart but the very next day you gave it away this year to save me from tears i'll give it to someone special and i forget the next part i regret so yes hopefully that's a nice little taste of that one i'll have to double check the rest and get back to you it, it's sad for having heard that song nine million times to go i should remember it better but yes now we have a little christmas time customer take my money let's get a few pick-me-ups just in case I got the money. And a few honey syrups. Stock up. We've got plenty of mushrooms. And you know, let's see. We've certainly stocked up. We are Gucci. Now, let's talk to this. I was about to say, Rose, uh, this Rose Town Toadette. What you got? Thick shirt. Let's buy ourselves a thick shirt. Put it on in the shop, don't look. Otherwise my stream gets demonetized. And some thick pants, equip them. And let's see, what else can we get? Do we want, <sighs> ooh, the fear status. You know, the fearless pin, I know it will affect, so that will end up affecting Actually, I'm trying to remember. I think fear is accuracy and strength. But it's a bit pricey. But maybe it would be good to get at least one more. What do I want? Do I want a wake-up pin? Do I want a true form pin? I think I want to get a... Hmm. One more wake-up pin. Yeah, one more wake-up pin. Just because things tend to be a little bit of a mess once uh, you fall asleep. Plus, you know, in case we meet another party member. Ba 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 I wonder. Well, I think we've just about finished exploring the town. So, how about we go stopping at the inn? Oh. Mario, help! <laughs> hey, Mario, are we taking care of Princess Peach now? <laughs> oh, boing, boing! Jump attack! Woohoo! <laughs> you think you can hurt me with your childish pranks? Mario over there in the corner just like, um, I'm not cool with this. Uh, this is very not true to real life. Kid, you know I would have jumped on his head right now. Do you know that I even saved the princess from him not too long ago in the chapter one? Uh, this kid. This kid. Attention, Peach! You're coming with me! Zip your lip! Day night. <laughs> help! Help! Oh, someone, please help me! I don't want to go on a date tonight! My eyeliner's not on nice! So, Pastor, what are we having tonight? Oh, uh, I made steaks. Oh, alright, that sounds nice. Yes, dear, I hear you. Oh, hello there. Why, aren't you Mario? Finally got the hat and the funky stash. Are you really Mario? Oh, yeah. 
I don't know. How do I know it's you? You might just be pulling my leg. Show me. Prove it. Mario, my dude, you gotta monetize this. I swear, everyone just asks you to show your stuff and jump. Well, wahoo. All right. Oh, hey, Mario, wanna play with me? I'm playing Save the World. Now, guys. Uh, now, guys. Mario might be a little tired, dear. <laughs> Every mother-child relationship going, honey, let the new guest rest for a little bit. Just, you know, they, they're a little too tired to play. Oh, come on, Mom! You never play with me! It's no fun playing alone! Oof. Big oof. I feel you guys. <laughs> oh, dear. Mario, I hate to ask, but could you play with Gaz for a little while? I'm almost getting into, like, a Michaela Laws cadence there. Oh, Lily, I am a night person by far. I am a creature of the night. In darkness, I flourish. <laughs> anyway. Yeah! So Mario's gonna play with me! <laughs> so, uh, yeah, Mario just bought the farm, uh, so, um, yeah, you can be Bowser. Wow, this kid is, uh, uh, I would get demonetized if I were to speak my true mind about this kid. And I'll be Gino, okay? <gasps> Gino? <gasps> Gino? Ready? Alright, let's play from where I let off. Left, uh, left off. Okay, enough of that. <laughs> Actually, you know, good at the Bowser thing, Mario. Now make sure that you treat your date right when you're playing Bowser, okay? All of a sudden, Peach looks over and goes, Um, my love, you sound a little different, a little very wahoo. Watch out, Bowser, cause Gino's gonna blow you away! Take this! Oh, wow! Uh. Your turn! Boom! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Time for your limit break. The super duper custom patented one and only shooting star shot! Whoa! Oh! Oh, I think I... Mess. Oops. Oops. Well. Hmm. Who this? Ooh, pretty. Duh. Oh. Maybe this? No, this one. No, this one? Mm, no. I think I know which one to go with. Ba 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 ba. Come to life. I'm a real boy. Hmm. Well, this body will certainly do nicely. Oh, oh I, a little awkward to get used to. Okay. Oh, oh, that, oh. Ow. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot. In the original, Gino does need a moment to kind of get his footing in the new body. We've seen the boy. After all the years of waiting, 27 years since the game's release, there he is. Oh, I had this nightmare. I was playing a Bowser and I was on a date with a Princess Peach and a kid who was a little brat. And, uh, yeah, what did he have? Uh, he had, uh, the, the, you know, the Gino character. What is a Gino? Who even makes that doll? Is that like a Sega character or something? Over, right? Now that we've rested up, down we go. Mom! You'll never believe what I just saw! 
It was amazing, Mom! I just saw Gino walking in the forest! Nina! Yes, dear, that's nice. Isn't Gino the one who broke my lamp the other day? Oof. Oof. <laughs> oh, Mom, that was just... You know, that, that, look, this is real! I swear, Mom, really, it's true. I saw him outside! All right, guys, let's hear it. What are you trying to get out of this time? Mom, I didn't do anything. I really, truly saw Gino walking into the forest! Darling, you need to not tell lies. Gazzy, Gazzy, yes, Mama. Telling lies, no. Oh, this boy is impossible. Oh, sorry if I hurt you. What would Gino want in the forest? Do we know? That's a guy say, not bad toys. <laughs> Hello! Save one more time. So don't need to rest. We are good to go for now. So it sounds like we are heading into the forest. Onward and upward, superstars. <gasps> oh my. What a classic, classic piece. So, once upon a lifetime ago, in the ancient days, of Overclocked Remix, knowing this to be one of the favorite songs that was done from Super Mario RPG and Remix. Mm, so good. Now, where is that? There's a hidden box. Where are you? Come on. Come to me, hi. Uh Aha. -huh. One Croca Cola. Yay, another mushroom. Hello, Wiggler. Oh, as he increases his defense. All right, Malo, let's take a peek at his mind. Friendly armless caterpillar until you get all angry. Defended. Not gonna spit on me. Rude. Ow. Well, botch the timing on that one. So, let's fight another one. So, fun little thing is how you can jump on the Wiggler for a number of hits and get a frog coin at the end, if I remember correctly. Oh, that's a lot of mushrooms. Ow! Uh-oh. You know, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna heal up a little bit. Because I realize I'm a little sloppy with my defense. There we go. Mmm. This is a pretty vicious wiggler. Dude, how many... Ow! Alright. Yep, I'm sloppy. Smack you for that. One hit. Yeah, there we go. Only one hit off. I know. It's kind of a funny thing is that the mushrooms that were the basis for Mario mushrooms are extremely poisonous. 
But man, do they look cool. Ow. Let's get ourselves a little more experience. And also practice with the timing. Hey, Keo. So right now, we have left Rose... Left. We've left Rose Town after meeting the small child Gaz and his toys. We have seen the boy in blue. The boy in blue is in the game. Everyone has been waiting for his debut. The boy in blue. Ah! Almost had five. Also, don't you just wish it was as easy to make money as it was in video games? I see Blue Boy, and all I can think of is just hearing Teasel Bon in my head from Mega Man Legends going, BLUE BOY! Dance, 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 da 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 Let's boost your HP, because that's where we got the most points we can get for this one. And now... Whoop. No. Bruh. Oh. <laughs> well, that's interesting. Donkey Kong? Ah, I botched that. Ow! Yep, lowers attack, that's right. Let's take another look. Donkey Kong? Ah. <laughs> Well, time to take you out. Oh. Is it time for a gauge move? You know, let's let's use it in another battle. I've almost beaten this one. Boom. what you get. What are you looking like taking a Bapoline? So, originally, that particular mob was known as Chained Kong. For a much, for a much, uh, a much more on-the-nose Donkey Kong reference. Alright. I on the Yoshi. I on the Yoshi. I on the Yoshi. Where's the Yoshi? Y'all guess? Where's the Yoshi? Left? Right? Center? Did you follow? Huh? Maybe? Maybe? What do you think the Yoshi is? Take a peek-see. Hmm? Which one do you think is the Yoshi? You think it's right? Anyone else? Any other guesses? Guesses? We got one left, we got one right? What do y'all got to say? Hmm. One middle? Uh-oh. I am going to guess... Right. Yoshi! Yay. More experience, nice -oo. And maybe jump on one more wiggler just to see. Ow. Tch. Too much. Ooh, speaking of mushrooms. One Amanita. My timing's wrong. Uh-oh. Well, this is appropriate. Mario's a mushroom. You are what you eat.
Bask in the sun, huh? Well, at least the nice thing about it being a mushroom is it's a good chance to heal up. Ow. Boom. Hmm. So, I'm gonna say... I would say cookies for that one. Yeah. Cookies preference over ice cream. Given I've got a sweet tooth for almost anything, but in general, I'd say cookies. Also, I really love just how, you know, kind of squat the creeper. Uh, pfft, the Wigglers are creepers. Wrong video game. Blech. Let's use a little Thunderbolt. Nope, not today. Now to beat up on the gorilla. Ow. There we go. I know, my mind is, it's almost as if I, it's almost as if I play Minecraft all day for a living. Mushroom. Oh, that's not a real mushroom. Bonk. Nice. Suit. All right. Hey, excuse me. Ow, rude. Well, we've already... There we go. There we go. Heck. All right, Buzzer, what do you got to say? Oh no. That would have not ended well. And thank you for resubbing, Skyline. How you be tonight? Ah. Man, I need to. I really need to practice my time jumps because I have not been doing well with those. Uh oh, we're both mushrooms now. Maybe I should have kept a true form pin on someone. But at least it's a good chance to heal up. Ow. <laughs> Come on, guys. Bruh. This might take us a minute. There we go. There we go. Now to fight another one of them. So let's take out Amanita first, because... Amanita break from the Amanitas. <laughs> that was dreadful. Alright. Take out the gorilla. And we take out... All of a sudden I was forgetting what the bee enemy was called again. Wasp. 
Okay, Mario gets the true form pin this time. So that we don't have something where everyone suddenly turns into mushroom. All right. Ow. <laughs> I'll say shiitake mushrooms are tasty. Been a while since I last had one. But they good. Ba 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 da ba 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 ba. Where is that hidden box? Where you be? Where you be? There you be. On front. Oop. You missed. Ow. Oh, this is a powerful one. Okay. Yeah, he's about to do some trouble. There we go. Woohoo! He plays Sandstorm for us. Now, let's get a honey syrup so we can heal up a little bit. So since the Wiggler's gonna cause us some trouble, let's take out the Gorilla first. Heal up Mario. Much better. Let's heal up Malo, because now Malo's having a bit of a rough time. There we go. Much better. Enough, Wiggler! What do you think this is, a Daruda concert? Let's see. I'm gonna fry you right about now. Ooh, 69 damage, nice. And this guy just does not want to go down. So, Kyo, to your question, it's fairly new that I've been doing this many live streams. A lot of it is, to me, it is very invigorating to perform. I love to put on a show. I love to have fun and just get to engage with everyone. So, it's something that is a nice thing just to get a little extra energy and... This is good for me. If I was doing a stream early in the morning, ugh, I would be very sluggish. It's like, howdy, superstars. I need my morning coffee. Okay, are we done yet? All right, so, yeah, let's get this on. Five more hours, please. So. <laughs> also, Marine, hello. How you be? Our resident emote maker who's done all the lovely things that y'all get to use in Chatland. Ooh. 
We got a sing redeem, huh? <laughs> I appreciate that, Shroom. I try to make sure things are fun for everyone. Let's see. All right, what we got? Also, seeing your message there. So, you're saying... Now, I, I've always said Malo. Are you saying Mallow instead? Uh-oh. Poison. Alright, take out the gorilla. You poison me and then you run out. Rude. Yeah, old habits die hard. Now, let's heal up. Which, it's interesting. I wonder if it might be a dialectical thing. I'd not seen... Actually, did I see an announcement where they had mentioned it? Ow. Okay, this is a little bit rougher. First, get rid of the Amanita. No, don't want to do that. Like, I know I'd always said Marshmallow, or... Actually, what did I say? Marshmallow. Not Marshmallow? Marshmallow. Let's heal up after this one. I'll say I appreciate... Hopefully it's not a matter of needing to get good, but, uh, feeling like they've changed a little bit of the balance of the battle, so it kind of ups the difficulty with the new special enemies you can encounter and whatnot. Let's see. Toad, what you gonna do for us? I'm gonna give you an attack that'll wipe these buggers out! Let's see, let's see. Ooh, an Octolot. Not seen those in a hot minute. Make sure you're not a special one, so I'm not gonna get too dunked on. Now, what you got to say? Uh-oh. Well, good chance to heal up now. Heal up, there we go. Ah, yes, I do have to sing. So, uh, Jillian, since you had claimed that, because of the time of year, is this a Christmas song or not? Another Christmas song, eh? All right. Well, after this, let us prepare our song as we get a little dance. Double check my words. Pick whatever is our best stat to boost. 
Ooh, I feel like I want to get attack and defense for this one. Let's up that a little bit. All right. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bells swing and jingle bells ring. Showing and blowing up snow. That. Oh, one more time, I give you rub. Actual lyrics, words, yes. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bells swing and jingle bells ring. Snow bell time, dancing and prancing in Jingle Bell Square. In the frosty air, what a bright time. It's the right time to rock the night away. Jingle bell time is a swell time. To go gliding in a one horse sleigh. Giddy up, jingle horse, pick up your feet. Jingle around the clock. Mix and a mingle in the jingling feet. That's the jingle bell rock. So, now that's a classic I've certainly heard many times over the years. So this is the full, this is the full transformation into a mean high girl. <laughs> Boing. No, you do not get to sting me. You take that stinger butt. And y I miss. Bruh. Ow. Well, you missed too. I didn't miss that time. Fire away. Yes, I am curious. How do I strike you? A chaotic soul crossing the internet? A right SOB? A nerd. <laughs> glitching out, eh? Oh, I'm always glitching out. Everything's always on the fritz. You know, it's part of the show. After all, what's a show if it goes too smoothly? Yay. I'm trying to think. Ah. <laughs> That's fair. That is fair. <laughs> Gilderoy Lockhart, huh? Oh my. Fine. <laughs> A bit flowery, a bit showy. Yeah, that sounds about right. I try to not write my own autobiography, though. That is a bit much. <laughs> Admittedly, he is Carly Simon levels of vain. That's wrong, sir. There we go. Yay. Let's wipe this bugger out. Don't you vigor up all like on me like that? No. Hmm. 
was trying to even remember, can Malo do a gauge move? There we go, okay. So you, so Mario calls him in. Now we get the attack. Here's a star gust! Let me wipe this bug out for you. Enough with the bloody vigor already! Bruh. <sighs> Have a good night, Childish Onigiri. <laughs> Stumble into the UK, whatever would make you think of that? Or I don't know, could go to a different part depending on what Hexen we're trying to make. You know, just a mashup uh. of all of the things. Jumping from place to place, wherever you might happen to be in the great UK. Or you know, you could even change it up a little bit and go across the pond to the other side. A little something different, outside the UK. They got their butts out of the UK as soon as they could. Eye on the Yoshi. Eye on the Yoshi. Eye on the Yoshi. Aha. Uh -huh. I already know. Yoshi! My best US impression, huh? Now, that's actually a fun little challenge right there, is if someone were to ask that and you go, okay, well, what part of the US? Because there is certainly a lot of US, and I'll tell you that New Jersey US sounds a heck of a lot different from Texan, if you know quite what I mean. We got a hidden treasure down here? What we got down here? Well, heck. <laughs> so I'd say whenever I'm feeling a bit America, it's like the cowboy spirit always tends to stand out the most, at least in modern days and times. So I'd have to slow my roll just a little bit. You know, I'm going for something that's a little bit, I'm going for something a little bit Dallas. You know, straight to the point, just a little bit of twang, you know, you have a discussion and, you get into, you gotta talk some business, you know. Work out a little commerce. Whether it's oil, or whether you're gonna be, uh, you know, trading some goods. Taking out them pesky bees. Pollinating them my magnolias. But you know, of course, like New Jersey's totally different. So, you know, you talk fast and, you know, everyone's in a rush to get somewhere. So your mouth moves really quickly and, you know, uh, you don't, you just don't know whether you want to go to, well, you just don't want to either have to deal with Philly or New York. So it's like, just get me out of here. Get me back to Jersey. I want to go back home. I want to pay the tolls and, you know, go down the shore. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm born and raised in the U.S. But, um, I'd say that's mostly North Jersey. South definitely has a different, has a, actually, <sighs> New Jersey accents. I used to get into discussions with this because you could hear about four different ones depending on what part in the state you're in. You're getting your very New York adjacent accent or you get your Philly accent. So mine, Philly, there's some things that you hear with New York, but the big thing you're going to hear in Philly is how you, how you, how you're going to consume certain things. Like you're going to drink water and then you're gonna watch the Eagles and then have a cup of coffee. And then you gotta go to Wawa and use you guys. I'm trying to think exactly how best to describe the Philly accent because I also, you know, don't want to get demonetized because it involves certainly a lot of the uh, four letter words in case you follow my drift. You gotta have like dripping content when you're talking. Let's get your attack and defense up. But you'll, you'll hear certain shifts, so whether you have... your Wooda in South Jersey, or if you have a more neutral, kinda sort of post-Jersey accent, you'll get... you'll just drink water, like a general... like in general American. Now, if you were to be asking me to go in Scottish, 
It's a little bit rougher. You know, like right now I'm able to sneak into the accent, but sometimes it's like, you know, I try to settle on Scotland and I end up falling into Russia. But you know, you find your way around the world and you always use your lead in the girl in the red dress as you go into a cheeky Pokemon battle. Oh, hi. Enough of that. My accent goes all over the place. I've had casting directors who can call out where I am from with certain words. And that's, that's always a fun thing to me is to listen in and go, there are some people that you can, you can generally detect where they're from if there's one particular word. Uh, and yes, I have been to Canada. It's been a hot minute since I was last in Canada, but I have at least been in Ontario. So, Niagara Falls, uh, Toronto. It was a long time ago when I was there, and I've at least been close, whether I've been in Detroit or been in Niagara Falls. I'd like to go back at some point. Scotty from Star Trek. I need to, you know, I need to go back and watch more Star Trek. Just because I know there is so much there. So much lore. Down we go. Do a little more exploring. The completionist here just has to see everything. Boom. Oh. Of, so, of the... Of my favorite places... Hmm. I'd say I have a one in the U.S. and one abroad. So, probably the favorite place I've been in the U.S. Let me think about this for a second. Is Austin, Texas. One, for the natural beauty Two, for the flavor of the people, the food, the atmosphere. For a good climate, except in the summer. And there's just nothing I've, I'd ever seen like Austin. And never a place that's been as warm in the United States. Abroad, I would say Madrid. I traveled there years ago, and Madrid, as someone once described it, is a city your heart will always return to. And similar thing to Austin. It is a beautiful, well, in its case, it's a beautiful city with a lot of history. It is a city where you go there, you don't really go there to be a tourist. The experience I had was to go there to live there for a few days. And just the very close friend that I traveled with, we just enjoyed cafes and just bars, walking late at night, just seeing everything that there was in the city, not worrying too much about. We didn't need to go to the uh, Reina Sofia. I will, oh, and I will add in Toledo as well, which... I kind of mash them together of Toledo and Madrid because you take you take the Ave and then boom, you're right there, or in that case the Avon. But um just experiences of, you know, you see the Plata Mayor and just look around at the architecture, the bits of history. The metro can take you anywhere, so it is a very walkable city, which even when I lived in, quote, walkable cities in the U.S., there eh, oftentimes leaves something to desire, to be desired. Yeah, words. And, um, just getting delicious paella, slow, relaxing dinner, not needing to wait about anything, just not needing to worry about anything. Um, and, you know, you just, you get a good glass of wine everywhere. 
The beer is dreadful, but that's almost an experience in Spain. And, um, yeah. I have a lot of very fond memories from that trip. And definitely somewhere that I've looked to return to at some point in my life. Uh, and which... Yes. Una taza de café con leche en plata mayor. Of course, my Spanish is a little weird because for the bits of Spanish that I do speak, <laughs> I picked up the ceseo from my... Or the ceseo from my friend. Uh, what was that thing? What, what did he say a little bit farther up? What's in the chat? I saw something in Spanish a moment ago. ¿Puedes darnos algún chico español? Or no, yeah. ¿Puedes darnos algún... ¿Puedes darnos... Algún chico español? Uh, could you please translate as I... Uh, no Tom screams right now. Yes. ¿Puedes darnos algún chico español? There we go. One hard thing about languages is just getting the rhythm down to it. So, there's... And I will not profess to be particularly good at speaking Spanish because it's not one that I've studied much of. I'd like to learn more. Oh my god. <laughs> um, that would be... There are circumstances where that could happen, but that would... <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh. Well, Mario, you pissed off that wiggler. Have a good night, Jillian. <laughs> so many secrets in this forest. I think I might have I might have been able to answer it. It's um I know just talking about American accents, because they're there's so much variety depending on the region that you're in. And you'll get your more quote-unquote neutral accents like say your Midwest in some varieties or your California and I, I love listening into accents in particular because it is something that is unique to you and where you come from and even what you value about where you come from so there might be some things where you might speak in a way that is very familiar to you if you no longer live in that place. I think of one family member who has a mashup of Midwest coming from Missouri and New Jersey. And it actually took a while to figure out exactly how this person's accent works. There were things I noticed years, just many years later. And, um... Yeah, it was a really interesting thing, just realizing the significance of why they spoke the way that they did. Oh, come here, come here, I want to fight you. I want to fight the mushroom. Boom. I want to brutalize the mushroom. Take that, Amasita! But anyway, yes, yeah, so I have been, I have been to, I have been to a few places in Ontario years ago. Ow. Nice. I whack you with my stick. <laughs> so, mm. Yours is, I'd say yours. You could blend in, Diamond. I'm trying to think if there are certain things that stand out. Um, but you could blend in with your accent. Gino! Hmm. Well, I think we need to go find our secret and then find our friend. What's all this talk about Canadian accents? Wow. 
Now, I will say how you can get some regional accents. You can also sometimes get almost a little bit of ethnic influence in an accent that transcends place and seems to be more culture-based. So there's some things I, I would not say... I'm trying to think from a linguistic perspective as I'm also trying to keep my timing. Nah, my mind is fried. <laughs> the rarest forest. Rar XD. Ooh, woo. Nope. Not today. Now, you know, let's actually heal up and find out what are we going to get from Toad. All right. Take this guy out in one hit. Boom! <laughs> Please give me huggy wuggies. Oh, woo. Pounces on you. Oh, woo. What's this? Notices your gameplay. Let's have a little look see. Very not cash money. Yeah, I need to... I, I probably have heard Ross Forest, but now I can't remember of it. I can't remember it. Blech. I will say, as my words do get a little mixed up, with it being late. Just excuse a little bit of the scrambled brain. You know. Defrag my mind at the end of the night. Or, better yet, run a trim command. <laughs> What's that? We don't talk too much about the things we've heard on the internet. Let's find our secret. Hmm. Interesting. So I now I had not I had not seen Nanbaka. I'm not sh I was familiar when it came out. I'm trying to think if I remember who Nico was. I knew people who worked on it. I'll say, Ross Forest, I probably have heard it. I'm just struggling to think of what that particular one sounds like. Hmm. Yeah, let me remind myself right now. Nico from Nanbaka. As we load get back into things. Who was that dude? Mmm, okay. I'm trying to think. I have to have seen this design a long time ago. Hmm. Played by Justin Briner. Okay, fun. Always did enjoy hearing his performances. Take out this Octolot. I'll say one thing I do appreciate about this game, particularly as an RPG, I like to grind in this game. So I know I'm taking it a little bit of a slower pace, but fortunately, the battles always felt nice and snappy Rather than this being a game where it just feels like, oh my god, how many more battles do I have to play? At least for me. So, left, left. Da da! <laughs> so, I never ate 
I never ate Santa's milk and cookies. I was raised to be a good boy. <laughs> and you know, Santa did always deliver. Plus, there were so many Christmas cookies going around in my family. <laughs> There's no regrets about sharing with Santa. All right. Nope. Nope. Ooh. Yeah, I imagine Santa enjoys a good thing of eggnog. Plus, you know, Santa always left such perfect penmanship, just such nice notes in perfect penmanship. That always looked very much like my father's handwriting. Hmm. All right, you just keep healing up, Mallow. Boom. Ah, pfft. timing all screwed up on that one, but Unomas. <laughs> and also, I will say, so... Any recipes, by all means, feel free to share them in the Discord. So, I know we've got others who do enjoy baking. And, uh... Yeah! Yeah, so I'll refresh my memory after the stream, because, I again, I probably have heard Ross Forest. I just can't think of it right now. Yeah, Ooh. Ham... Ham bone soup. Now that sounds delicious. <laughs> Is Santa a denizen of the internet? So let's see if I did this correctly. Ow. Just for that, I'm gonna take you out. Rude. <laughs> so, Hallmark movies, they... What do I say about Hallmark movies? I've got family members who love Hallmark movies. It's one of those things, they're, they're intended to have a certain feeling, and just, you, there's a time of year where you want to watch something like that, not have to think about it too much. There's no shame in liking them. <laughs> not my thing. You know, the plot starts getting a bit savvy after the same time, going, all right, businesswoman from the city decides to go to a rural small town to get away from the misery of the city, falls in love with handsome dude, uh, who happens to be in that small town, suddenly realizes that, you know, you don't need to have the craziness of the big city when there's love in this small town, and it's natural and real, and... Oh, a Christmas memory that's brought you together. Super Fireball! Nice, Sue. Well, let's up our HP, because now we got... Lots of power. Ow. Bruh. We find out Santa has perfect mimicry of everyone's handwriting, but can't write. <laughs> so I think there, I think there is an energy about how I think there is an energy about this game's music that is a bit reminiscent of some of the stuff that goes into the uh, FNAF music. Just a, a lot of the very happy feeling. Oh, oh, no, we did it wrong. Left, left. Oh! No, that's definitely the wrong way. Let me try this again, because I know I definitely did not do that right. So, I think if I remember correctly, testing that out left, 
left, straight, there we go, right, here we go. Then, in Gino's maze, pop, 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 pop. Ah, yes, is Ross Forest the one that does have the lyrics? In that case, yes, I have heard. Super Mario RPG, it is the only game just for me. More mushrooms. Now, let us find our way back and chase our blue boy. Sir, where are you going? Why are you running? Why are you running? Now nah, we'll fight the mushroom. Bang, bang. Yeah, FNAF World especially, with the bounciness that that game has in a lot of its music. Uh oh. Dude's still getting his earth legs. Okay, he's going that way. Oh, I think we're close. Now, having a little insight of what we want to do ahead of this one. Let's keep Malo awake. And I know I'm just going to slip into saying it with that ah sound. Ah is a sound that, ah versus ah, knowing how that vowel works in English, it's, it, it takes a while for my mind to process that. Save point. Are we about to encounter a boss battle? Non-alcoholic Baileys, how does that work? Interesting. So, I will say that, mm, best cookie flavor, best cookie flavor. I love anything with peanut butter in it. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, put in Creative Showcase, by all means. <laughs> yeah, music is most definitely welcome. Show off your stuff. Arrows. The cover they run, yeah. Fun, this is, yes, yeah. Another 1,000 will I shoot. Bowyer. Happy I am, yeah. Look, look at their expressions when breeze they do. Woohoo, they're standing like statues. Yeah, more practice do I need. Who do you think you are, Bruce Lee? <laughs> Mario. Ah, time to learn the deal. Oh, it's a star, like the one we saw before. What? Ooh. What, what? This time you must not practicing, I am. More arrows must I shoot, more statues must I make. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. Hold it right there. You don't know what you're doing. Return that star to me. How stranger you are, and strange looking at that. Teach you we must who's in charge. Oh. He serves a higher authority. That star piece belongs to everyone. You can't keep it. Well, he's not happy. Uh-oh. Teach a lesson, eh? Oh, 
Uh oh. Oh no. A theory with Gino, eh? Whack that weirdo. Save the guy in blue. Nice. <laughs> Very brave of you. Works with Rosalina. Mario World? Lore confirmed? Rosalina and Gino exist in the same universe? Oh. Nice. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Whoop. Ah, thanks for the help. But who are you? Huh, Mario, you just ditched me back there! Huh? Wait, don't I know you? You look familiar. So, you're the Mario. <laughs> we know about you! Interrupt. I'll, yep, I did see the song, so I'll try to get that to that in a second. First. Well, actually, you know what? While we're about to take on Bowyer. Hopefully the melody won't get copyrighted. <sighs> Had to deal with Babby's first copyright troll not too long ago. Ba -ba -da -ba. Can't wait to meet you. So join the animatronic family. We open real soon. Try your best to hold on to sanity. Come get to know me. And you won't want to leave after tonight. Down here we're lonely. And we would love you to join us for a bite. You've been through 20 long, frightful nights. You've seen their faces, felt all their bones. Bites. You know our show is so far from over And Freddy told us you're an organ donor All eyes are on you We can walk you through all of our fantasy Learn what we've gone through We can teach you to laugh at tragedy You thought the nightmares ended back at Freddy's We're all still right here So let's get friendly we're feeling festive join the party we'll try hard not to bite anger is restless don't hold it against us we're all right the fun is starting a celebration that lasts eternally i'm always watching ah let me try that again we're feeling festive Join the party, we'll try hard not to bite. Anger is restless. Don't hold it against us, we're all right. The fun is starting. A celebration that lasts eternally. I'm always watching. Cause somebody purple murdered me. We'll be found down deep underground. What have I done to deserve this damnation? Who knows if you're the one to blame cause we don't even know your name but you're here now and we've got temptation <laughs> we're only playing just wanted to make a few new friends you plan on staying when you're with us the party never ends you might look at me and think you're going crazy i lost it long ago you're not alone baby i can't wait to meet you so join the animatronic family we open real soon try your best to hold on to sanity come get to know me and you won't want to leave after tonight down here we're lonely only and we would love you to join us for a bite and we would love you to join us for a bite so that is join us for a bite as originally composed by JT music lovely lovely FNAF fan song based on sister location now how about we show this bugger up
Oh! Nice! Time for a little attack. Boom! On fire! Let's take a look at this guy's thoughts. No weaknesses. <laughs> Three against one. Alright. Here we go. Wait. You like the toad assist too? Ow. Heck. Well, super fireball it is. Let's take this bugger out. Button mash, button mash. Boom. Nah, I don't need anything there. Whack. Oh. All right. Well, you're going to have it now. Now, what do I have to use? Ah, yes. Let's go with just another fireball. Actually, no. We'll go with the jump. And for this, give ourselves a honey syrup. Yeah, I was trying to remember that. Oh, that's right. Gino. Uh, unfortunately, Gino is not... Yeah, Gino has a bad time without anything for uh, defense. Alright. Eighty-eight hit points per hit? Nice. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Heal up our friend. All right. Well, lucky me, I have the wake up pin on Malo. Am I about to kick your butt? Whoa! Uh-oh. What? So, wait, what do we do? Oh. <laughs> I know what we're about to do. Dirty tricks, huh? No allies. You're going down, bucko. Triple moves. We get to see the new thing. All right, Malo. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Beautiful. Now that was magic. Ah, oh, thanks for the help. You really got me out of a jam. I'd love to try it again. Ah, oh, thank you for the help. You really got me out of a jam. <laughs> Wait, why are you staring at me? You know that I'm more than just a doll, don't you? <laughs> Have you guessed the truth? I'm a visitor from above, and this is a form I'm borrowing briefly. <laughs> you mean like from the sky or something? Higher than that, I'm afraid. Do you two know anything about the Star Road? Mm -mm. Ah, completely in the dark, eh? Well, it's a big mess up there right now. 
and it concerns you too. Let me explain. You've heard of wishing upon a shooting star. At the Star Road, your wish is transformed into a star. When it's granted, it, tur it then turns into a shooting star and falls down to Earth. So you see, the Star Road plays an integral role in granting wishes. But, ever since a sword destroyed the Star Road, everything's come to a halt. No stars have been made since. The way things stand, yours is a world where wishes can't come true anymore. Wait, are you saying this star is a part of your starway? <laughs> that's Star Road, my fluffy little friend. Yes, that star is a broken piece of the Star Road. I'm here to find them all and repair the Star Road. The broken star pieces. There are seven altogether. For peace to return, we must get rid of Smithy, find the star pieces, and repair the Star Road. I'm... but that's hard to pronounce, so... Call me Gino, after the doll. I chose him because he looked the strongest out of all the dolls. <laughs> the shade! Now, grab the star, Mario. Mario over here like, This bitch! This bitch! Think he's the strongest of all the toys! Looks at me and, uh, like, pass it right over. Well, Gaz did say you bought the farm. <laughs> ba -ba -ba -ba. Star darlings. We have two. Nice. Thank you, Anna Elsa. I appreciate you saying that. Well then, come on. Let's get this show on the road. Gino, who is searching for the pieces of the Star Road, joins Mario and Mallow. Things are definitely looking up. Uh-oh. I heard everything! Who would have known that star was so important?! I've got to inform Smithy! The secret to the shooting stars has been unraveled. Find the star pieces and bring peace back to Mario's world. And out we go. We have escaped the forest maze. <gasps> Welcome back to Rose Town. Now a lot brighter. You're welcome. That is me. Oh, Mario is so wonderful. That is me. Uh, he is the most wonderful hero. I am saying that he is me. I am literally standing in front of you. Oh, that Mario. I give up. Ah. The grandson step out. <laughs> there we go. You're welcome, madam. I got you, fam. Everything is looking up. Mushrooms in the forest, eh? Well, there's certainly plenty of those. Ba 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 ba. You can't believe it. Well, yeah, that kind of happens when you do step outside. You have a chance of arrow rain on your head. Beautiful. Is 
So I'm trying to remember, did we have someone hiding behind? No. No one's stuck there. Was there someone? Ah, yes, hello. No, I've not been to Yoster Island yet. Guys. So, I played this game 27 years ago. Or however long ago it was, my mind is fuzzy right now. That is the first time I just realized the Yoshi's Island in this game is a pun. A pun on Easter Island. <laughs> wow. I always wondered, why Yoster Island? Why Yoster... Oh, I get it now. So, you know, it is never too late for you to notice something in a game. A boom from the mountains. A big kaboom. An earth-shattering kaboom. Do we need anything else? I think actually we're pretty good on that right now. I haven't needed too many healing items. But you know, maybe... Nah, none of the clothes fit Gino. We need to get his defense up. He's running around a little naked right now. Ah, uh, what do we want to use? Actually, we, I think we've got some equipment already we can equip. What do we want to give him? Don't have anything there yet. Accessory... Let me give you the awake pin. And, you know, defense-wise... Yeah, we can give Signa Ring to Mallow. Do, 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 do. Hello, bratty child! I brought your toy back! You can keep him! Hello, Dragon Master. Thank you for popping in. Right now, we have just fixed up Rose Town and Super Mario RPG and gotten our second star piece. And we're dealing with this little brat who disrespected us. But you know, at least he's got good taste. He's shipping his Bowser and Peach dolls, so you know. He's okay. Teehee. Gas, were you actually telling the truth to your mom? <laughs> yeah, yes, Gino is a Gino is a cosplayer confirmed. Missing Yes, we need to find the rest. Tell him, Gino. Well, Gas, it's like this. So, a star goes out, and then all of a sudden, you grant a wish on the star, like my friend does here. I wish for happiness. This is how it used to be. But now it's like, so I send a star out. I wish for happiness. Depression. I wish for happiness. I got depression. Now, do you understand? <laughs> Let's say if things stay the way they are, your wishes will never come true. That is correct. No one's wishes will come true. Oh! <laughs> this, this little brat, this little brat, oh, I am... <laughs> Lol, Mario. Something sparkly fall around Moleville. Make that our next stop, eh? Oh, ooh. what? You got a thing for us? He's got a thing for us. 
a conveniently full-sized finger shot. Mario. This child. Who is this lost sassy child? Wahoo! Although, big mood. Big mood. <laughs> well, let's give Gino his finger shot. Which definitely ups his up. Yep. One of the nice things, Gino is dreadful defense. But he packs a mean punch. Ba 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 ba. Now. Ah, and a nice thing how we can always take a nap when we need. Now, I believe if we take a rest. I'm the creature of the night, y'all. The night charges my system. And because we played with a bratty son, we get a ch Link! <gasps> he came to town. Come to save the Princess Zelda? Ganon took her away. Now the children don't play. But they will when Link saves the day. Hallelujah! Oh! <gasps> The journal, huh? Did we find something? Someone heroic looking was sleeping in the Rose Town Inn. I bet he's tired from his legends or adventures, but I'd like to link but I'd like to link up with him and chat over a tadpole of cola. <sighs> Ma Malo, you're gonna be following in the hero's footsteps, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is adorable. This journal is... This journal is so much fun. Yes, from the first battle. When we took on the Hammer Bros. Chase Croco! Got our first coin. Took out Clay Morton. Now, this is the one I've always tried to figure out whether it was... I've always said b -Lome. Just since that's what I've said since I was a tadpole. But, uh. Yeah, I don't know if it's that or Bellome. Mm. I love it. Malo's like, mm, I don't know if. Yeah, I don't know if he can actually get back. And so, Balom or Balome? Just trying to make sure I'm following with what I'm seeing. Hey, Ali, thanks for popping in. Bueno. All of our monster lists. I'll say, I for how to say things. I always, I love whenever I can find a reference in the in IPA because the international phonetic alphabet is nice. As sometimes I'll see certain vowels. I've been razzed about this a few times because there are certain phonetics in languages like Greek used to drive me nuts because I'm used to Latin-based vowels and Greek where. An A sound where you see the letter E, an A sound is actually read as an E, so you get a word like epitome. Always throws me off. Take a look at this weirdo. He was weird. <laughs> yeah, I guess I had typed in the had a little bit of a uh, tech issue at the start of things as um, Right now the restream relay is acting up So
Yeah, unfortunately, the restream relay. I don't know what's going on with Twitch right now. Either the restream API is acting up or Twitch is being obnoxious. So all y'all on the YouTube side can see everything. As for the other side, well, Twitch gonna Twitch. Not like they take 50% of your revenue on subscri subscribers and anything. Well, onward and upward. So, head down to the pipe vault so we can find our way to Yoster Island. Bada bada bada. Bada bada bada. Ow. Nailed it. Oh, <gasps> Goomba. Ooh. Oof. Have a good night, Dolly Chan. Now, let's get our tattle from that Goomba. So. Wait, what am I doing? We, Yeah, we actually saw the Goombas at the start of the game. All right. Thunderbolt to take y'all out. I don't know why for some reason I thought Goombas, we didn't fight them at the beginning of the game. Now, Piranha Plants, on the other hand, we have not fought them yet. Oh, yeah. You can't jump on Piranha Plants. I forgot. There we go. Big move, Piranha Plant. Big move. Nah, save that for later. Boom. Whack. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Boom. I know, here in my forgetful memory, forgetting the things I have done as Gumi High. Ow! Bruh! Bruh. Rude. Ow. Come on, let me jump on you. Ow. Oh, now I'm just getting all thrown off. Hmm. All right, Mello. Nice. I'm trying to remember. Okay, so you can. That's right. Now, how do we duck and slide again? It's so sad. I know there is a very specific way to do that slide. This is like the only part of the game where you slide to get something. And now I'm trying to remember what the button is. Hmm. Why am I forgetting this? How do you get... There's our hidden treasure. How 
how do we get that frog coin again? Jump at the open end. Is that right? There's the other one. Why am I forgetting? Come on, come on. I need to remember how to do this. Because I know I need to slide. Jumping at the open end, you said. First, let's... Yeah, I'll try that one more time. Good night, Mario. Boom. <laughs> well, fortunately, Gino packs a mean punch. <laughs> Definitely not going to be singing that one on stream. So, is it indeed holding R still? How do you get that frog coin nowadays? Is it holding L? No? L and R? Nope. How do you do it nowadays? Not actually R. L2. So that's what I've been trying to do, is L2, but it, it does not appear to be activating. It's, unless, no. That's it. Okay, thank you. Now I'm trying to remember if it was hold R or if it was actually just press down. Which feels so unintuitive when playing an isometric RPG like this. Oh well. Boom. Ah. Well, let's defend his Geno for a second. And also heal up our friend. Boom. Nice. Nighty night. And one more. Hey, 856, how's it going? Just enjoying a little Mario. Funny Wahoo Man. All the funny Wahoo Man. I know it's funny the choice of enemies when you get into 
why am I forgetting the name of it? When you get into this particular level, because at this point, you're probably leveled up high enough where it's just, you're just blasting through everyone. Woohoo! Nice. There we go. I like the sound of amazing cakes, most certainly. All right. Time to unleash the power of friendship in Rainbow Road. I just wish it had attack power. Uh, or wish it had splash damage. One more. Ah. Yeah, 856, that is... Ouch. I empathize with that. <laughs> oh dear, I have... I've had... I have had... I had some dreadful sleep hours in college. I would wake up for my 8 a.m.s at midnight. There we go. Have we almost made it? Also, I appreciate the little detail that this is just a pot in this one as opposed to a pipe. Oh, nippers. Those little buggers. All right. Use some of that splash damage to take it, everyone. All right, time to wake up now. Let's see. Boom. Man, I really love how they just changed that to where you will have that splash damage across multiple enemies. Come on. Wanna fight the piranha plant? Boom. Be like Hat Girl. Boom! Booyah! Y'all going down. Although now, I doubt Nintendo would ever allow oh, it, but I'm just imagining an Among Us that somehow snuck itself into this game. Go away, little weird nipper. You may not have my coins. No bueno. Boom. Aw, therapy pups. Ah, uh, innocent to innocent dogs are too good for this world. Ow! There we go. Funny, I don't remember it moving like that. All right. Well, time to fight the goom. So, dogs shedding during the winter, I mean, dogs shed it, any breed of dog that sheds, sheds at any given time. I just know it's, um, how they'll get their thicker coat in the winter. Yay. 
Yay. Get herself a flower coin. Frog coin. Blech. Hello, Yoshi. Oh. I don't speak, Yoshi. Wow. Nothing inside, eh? Let's read the mail. Huh. Honeymoon reservations. Hey, Green Yoshi! You are friend Yoshi that we know because you are green. I know, I just like going around to talk to him. Mushroom Derby. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't speak that. You saw the star. Why can't you race together? What's the matter? Ah, yes. Boshi's kind of a jerk and doesn't want us to race together. So we need to show him up. <laughs> Gotta love it. Mario can read the letter. Yoshi can't. All right, punk. So you got the cookies. Got yourself a race. One on one. Sure, let's see if the timing's any different in this one. Do you have rhythm? All right. about the timing? Hmm. What is going on with the... Hmm. I wonder if it's input delay. Otherwise, I just need to get good. Where is this timing? Hmm. Tell you what. Let's try something else. Let's see how the Joy-Cons fare. See if these are any better. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, one, bum, 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 what? Huh? Why? Interesting. Why am I not? Hmm. You think for how many times I actually beat this in the Super Nintendo version? Now this is just totally off. What is the deal with this? What is the deal with this? Hello, BBBB. B, B, B. I might just straight up try it, because I feel like something is weird about the rhythm in this. Hopefully it's not a skill issue. 
bum 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 Okay. Let's try with our pro controller one more time. Is it input delay? All right. Boom, 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 boom. It's so bizarre because here I think I'm pressing it in time with the rhythm. And at least what I can see on the visuals on my side, it is in time with the rhythm. Hmm. Bum, bum. A, B, 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 A, B. <sighs> you know what? Let's just go for it. Let's see if the race is any more forgiving. There you go. Hey, why can't I use my cookie? There we go. You see? <laughs> the rhythm is so much more forgiving in the game. I don't know why the tutorial was that difficult. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Cookie stash for the winner. Wow. Huh, cookies. Nice. I'll say right on cue, Christy. <laughs> Speaking of cookies. Amazing how easy that is. You know what, let's even try one more, just to see how it goes. Come on, Boshi. Here we go. Let's wager three. See how we do with this one. Et voila. <laughs> Double our cookies. Wow. Well, mission success. Thank you, Yoshi. Now that I got my Yoshi's cookies. So I'm trying to think, yes, our Yoshi's cookies, if I remember correctly, allow us to summon you in battle. We can carry a lot of cookies. Yum. Delicious. Well, onward to Moleville. Might be time to call it a night soon, as I know we've been going for just a little short of three hours now. Oh. Nah. Not staying right now. But we are certainly saving.
Ah, Moleville. Hi. <laughs> Our boy is bad. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Bowser, most of our allies have run off. W what will we do? We've only had experience fighting Mario. These new guys are too tough. <laughs> Shut up, all of you! I'm the biggest, baddest brute around, and don't you forget it! What if Mario here's a little bit kicked out of my own castle? Oh, my reputation will be ruined! <laughs> oh, even I have an image to keep up, you know. Let's show them who's boss around here! <laughs> oh, poor Bowser. I'll say, I love this game. One of the reasons being that it was one of the first games ever where we got to see Bowser be a bit of a derp. And... One of the archetypes I love is super tough. Okay, yeah, you'll you'll never crack my shell. Okay, fine. Just I'm trying to conceal that I'm a little insecure. Hello, Silkwing Butterfly. Getting ready to call it a night fairly soon, but you know, a little more exp little bleh, exploration, I words can say. Let's buy ourselves some useful stuff. This mushroom is mid. All right, get Mario. Mallow. All equipped. Gino is good to go. Get ourselves a mega shirt. Yes. Get ourselves. Wait, actually. Hmm. You know what? I think we all want the work pants. Is the stat boost? Oh, yeah. That stat boost is worthwhile. Now. Don't need the Koopa shell anymore, so tittles! I'll say one thing that's also a nice touch is that the sentimental items, it goes, no, 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 no. You're not selling the staff that you got from... I'm actually trying to remember his name in this version. I would about to call him Frog Fuchsius, but go, no, no, they changed that. But we will sell the shirt off our own back. And the thick shirt. And also the mega shirt that we just bought and wasted money on. But you know what, whatever. Now, if I remember correctly, we probably want to get... Oh, pfft, darp. Maybe buy another wake-up pin at some point. Because those are quite... Frog Sage, thank you. Yeah, the jump shoes, I never really found them to be all that useful. I would just go, usually my physical attacks were enough. So 
So, I think we are at a good pause point because we could take another probably hour, hour and a half to get Dinah and Might. So, we'll save those little girls in time. But, let's save now that we got our stuff. Thought I did. Did I just save? Hmm, let's see. I want to say, guys, it has been an absolute blast playing with you all tonight. <laughs> My mind is a little fried right now, so excuse me as I'm trying to think, okay, what do I say? What is word? <laughs> but... There we are. All right. So... I want to thank you all for joining tonight. It has been an absolute blast playing with you all. Thank you so much for tuning in. Let's get the music pulled up so we can get ready to call it a night. There we are. Switch out of that. It's always a lot of fun joining you guys. And thank you so much for just taking time out of your day to just tune in and have fun. When you were born, something <laughs> There's something sentimental I want to say, and I apologize that my mind is just firing blanks right now. <laughs> but I'm always appreciative. And guys, just thank you for being awesome. With every passing day the world can always use some more fun, some more creation, some more art. And whatever you want to do, come up with something fun. Come up with something inspirational. Remember that the world is a stage. So get out there and make it a show, superstars. Put a little spark into life. And never let your creativity be erased. Gonna be away for a few days, but we're gonna have some fun next week. Gonna hop back in for a few more games. I don't quite know what uh, our rhythm's gonna be yet. Now that I got the rhythm of Yoster Island down. <laughs> but, guys... Again, thank you so much for tuning in. I'll let you know when we're going live with another adventure soon. And until then, get out there and make something awesome. Stay awesome, superstars. And I will talk to you all soon. Peace out, my friends. Carry us away.